Hi everyone and welcome to Journaling Junkie. I'm here today to show you this um, journal that I made quite a while ago. Um, and uh, as I've, I've just forgotten about it completely and just came across it. So uh, here's a video uh, showing you. It's really pretty um, and it will be for sale in my Etsy store once this uh, video is uploaded. It measures uh, seven and a half inches by five and three quarter inches. It's got so many different laces in. This cover is beautiful. Um, the photograph um, I've actually put behind um, some vellum paper. So it gives it a really delicate look. And on the back, I've just embellished it with this. And beautiful papers. Um, I will put a link to the kit that I used um, down below, um, so if you want to go and check it out, you can do. Okay, so we'll get straight into it, and uh, I hope you enjoy the video. So it just fastens with this uh, lovely lace. Excuse my silly hand. Um, it fastens uh, with this lace here. Um, but I will also include some rings, so if you prefer that rather than the lace, um, you could put those in as well. Okay, so lots of uh, layering and delicate laces. I don't know if it's picking up uh, these here, tiny beads on. So we'll get straight into it. As you can see, the the pages are beautiful you know the design on here just gorgeous so I have this lovely uh, image and tucked away here there's this uh, lovely card uh, it's very pink as you can see and very rose themed so I've got some vintage book page and this beautiful lace here again with the beads on Just get that right, there we go. So here with a large journaling card, uh, just delicate stenciling on. It's very different for my style, um, but I, I remember at the time I did enjoy making this. So here with a, a large belly band. So I've uh, printed the page out twice and then made, made that so it, it fits. And then this envelope, and in here with all sorts of uh, bits of ephemera that have been left over. So I've included them. Quite a little bundle in there. Lots of journaling space. And then here, this cute little uh, card. And some uh, vintage crocheted lace here, little embellishments. And then here, that's come out because I've just been photographing. As you can see, there's some acetate there. So I made like a little pocket and then this comes out. lots of lovely collaging on the pages then here large journaling tag again this is I've put this behind some um, vellum so it makes it even more delicate I hope it's picking it up on there large journaling tag here And then just some little pieces of ephemera in there. Here with a large tag. I'm going to have to stop putting things back now. So here with this, 
this lovely is decorated with some pretty lace there and this flips up let me just move it down a little bit and in here it's a little envelope pocket there Two journaling tags, a little bit of decoration there, large journaling tag. As you can see, I've used lots of laces, etc., throughout. And this is a page out of a book um, that I got all about love letters. And it came in little envelopes and everything, but unfortunately they were stuck on the page, so I couldn't get them off without tearing them. But this is uh, one of the letters out of it. It's a really sweet book. So another uh, little side pocket there. And it's got some uh, real sil silk around here. Really pretty. Some of some of the ephemera, as I say, is my own. Uh, some is out of the kit. Some crocheted lace there, and then here this little pocket, of pieces of ephemera in there. I've used here the same uh, decorations as I did on the front with the tiny little beads in there. So pretty. And then we have a, a journaling tag. Right, I'm not going to bother doing that now. <laughs> Lovely writing space there. This pretty little picture here, a photo should I say, that slides out. Again I've used um, the, the vellum paper on there. Lots of embellishments, fussy cuts. And here this little pocket, again I fussy cut this out and stuck it onto this pocket. I'm just going to pull those out of there rather than try and fiddle with this silly hand of mine. So a large journaling tag and another little envelope there. I could actually st stick that down and use it as a tuck spot there, a tuck spot behind or from the top. And then here, this lovely page I've covered with the crackle accents. Two large journaling tags, this mm -hmm. lovely image here. Yeah. And again, I've used that beautiful mm -hmm. fabric there. Yep, yeah. little tuck spot there. And then this flaps out. Another little envelope pocket there with some ephemera in. Excuse my dog snoring in the background. More journaling space there. And then here. lovely lady. Again lots of lace used and then a large journaling tag in there as well really delicately printed and then the back 
you could decorate or use that as more journaling space or you could stick that down put that inside and still have a space there uh, as another tuck spot and then we've come to the back page how pretty it is Okay, well I hope you've enjoyed looking through this journal with me. As I say, it will be available in my Etsy store um, and I will be including the, I can't think what they call them, like a lockable ring so that if you didn't want the lace, you could use them if you prefer. Okay, well, thanks for watching and take care and I hope to see you all soon. Bye for now.